Cookie Swirl. See? <laughs> It is finally time! It's been a long time. We're playing Hogwarts Legacy again. So I want to see what happens. I never made it to the town, Hogsmeade. But you know what? We're going this time. Rebellion. So, I am back, but the professor promised I could definitely go to town. So we're going. So I just have to find my way outside. There's Sebastian. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It yes. is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavor to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need, shall Perfect. we? Perfect. Yes. Okay, we get to leave the school for the first time. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. Thomas You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way <laughs> I see it... I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm That's a good still thing. surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. <gasps> Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well-rounded. <laughs> Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. Look at the watering can. Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Huh. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Yeah, well, what'd you do? I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. Oh, really? She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and <gasps> I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Ooh! Oh, just one moment. This is, is an it? excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. These? Should we collect some? Okay, we've got some. Great, right, we can make a potion later. Oh, look at it! They're like little trumpet flowers. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look. What's going on? What's happening? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? How beautiful! You don't see that every day. They're gorgeous. Are they going to the school? Poppy's already seeing the hippogriffs. Oh, are they hippogriffs? To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I <gasps> think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Look to me, just past those ruins up ahead. Have you had much of a chance to explore the castle? A little. Yes. It's positively enormous. <gasps> it Who's this that? coming in the carriage? I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Those They're Pegasus. Places to discover. Oh, any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. Look! I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still okay, they're more than just Pegasus. They are so very bony, weird-looking dragon horses. Oh, they're eating their candies. They look like they do not want to share. Look at them ignoring me. They're twins. Okay, it looks like they want to be left alone. I've always thought Thestral's pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though Why I are these mushrooms most moving? Don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Leaping toadstool caps. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. I got him. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. There's a cat. Yeah. Hey little kitty. Aww. Oh, the cat turned into a different cat. Oh, it's magical. Hi, I can't forget about you. Mr. Moon. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks Who's a bit guy? worse for wear. Is this him? Hello, Mr. Moon. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything wrong with him? Sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Okay. Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment. But she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. We made it! Hogsmeade, we made it! We made it! All right! What a cute little town! This feels like um, Honestly, Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> one to bottle the magic of this place. I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just <gasps> something about Hogsmeade. What are they brewing here? flock to it like moths to a flame. Hello! You look great in purple. Excuse me? This guy okay? Look how he fell asleep. I hope he's all right. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spellcrafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. 
Can't wait to see what you do with a new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have <laughs> to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Okay, don't get in trouble. Have fun. It's Hogsmeade. I have a feeling he's gonna get into some trouble. All right, here's the village. This is very big, too. There's so much to see, so much to do. Look it! He's gonna practice riding the broom. Is this kind of like a bull ride thing? But, you know, it's a broom. <laughs> Come on, ride that broom. Ride it. No, he seems a little scared. Oh. That must be his first time on it. Yeah, definitely. He's gotta get his balance. So you gonna try again? He's making sure the wood is just right. Okay, there we go. Try it again. Oh. There, much better. Yeah. What about over here? What's going on over here? What are we looking at? Oops. Sorry. It's a little reading corner. Ah! Oh, there's another flu flame here. Wow. Interesting way to practice with your magic wand. A magic mirror. Oh, there's some students. Hello. All right. Just let them have their conversation. Oh, I need that note. Where did it go? Oh, look, you guys, the little tea area. They're all sipping and having their tea. Look at tea time. There it is again. Got it. Fireworks? Look at this little kid. He's practicing for whenever he gets a broom with a broken broom. Don't worry. One day you'll have your broom of your own. Oh, hey. There you are. Good. You're not getting any, any trouble. Hey, kitty. Aw. Cute little Hogsmeade kitty. <gasps> Honey Dukes. They're so cotton candy. Look at it. It's dancing in the window. It's the candy shop. Look at how delicious this is. Look at the cupcakes. Oh, I definitely have to get some of these. It looks delicious. Okay, this time this window's gonna dance. Yum. <gasps> There's another paper. Grab it. I got it. Another one? There's so many pages flying around here. So the costume I got the it. Oh, gosh, He's getting trouble. in trouble. I'm very sorry, Father. Only she said I might earn a reward. Oh, instead, I just wasted our time. There you are. Huh. Oh, fine. I'll have enough for wind wisp. Ah, well. It's gone. Not meant to be. There's so much to explore in town. There's another kitty. Hi, kitty. So cute. Stop What's over there? Look at the guy in purple. He just wants to be left alone. Excuse me. Oh, he's using magic. Oh, he's getting a shop ready. Come in, we're open. Which shop is yours? The one with the fish? J. Pippin's potions. Oh, he's a sign flipper. Oh, look it. She's learning. Paige, I saw it. Got it. All right, back in the main town. We've got all these ratted rags, and then they've got like a wolf skin. There's an owl. Look at all the colorful food. And then there's just a dead chicken. Two dead chickens. Look at that. Purple carrots. Look at the tricks and joke store. That sounds fun. Oh, they're trying to sneak a peek inside the store. They're looking at all the tricks. Can I go in? It's open. What are they looking at exactly? What are they looking at? Oh no, boxing telescope. The frog got knocked out. Oh, unicorns. Gillyweed tonic. Look, the presents are wrapping themselves. Here comes the next one. It's wrapping. This is what somebody wanted. And now it's ready for a pickup. <gasps> okay, we can go upstairs. Oh, it's going across the tightrope. Look at he's playing with the, oh, he's hitting himself in the face. I don't think he should do that. I don't think he, okay, the ball has, <laughs> the ball has a mind of its own. He's gotta keep it contained. Bad ball, bad ball. Okay, he should be careful. Tempest in a bottle. So let's see this duck try to go across the tightrope. I was trying to balance on the money. What do they have over here? Bewildering can of mystery. Quality surprises canned and distributed by Anderson Bros Co. Oh, it is a surprise. Hopefully they don't charge me for one of those. That was just the sample one, right? Don't push. Should I push it? Should I push it? Nah, just kidding. Of course we're gonna push the button. Let's see what happens. Oops, oops. Oh no, the poor duck. Oh no, oh no. What is that? That's confetti. Oh no, there's a store owner right there. He's probably mad. He knows I pushed it. Cause he was standing right over there. Let's get back downstairs. Look at the confetti. Oh no, it's dropping money now. That poor duck. What is this? Musical balloons. How does it work? Oh, there it goes. Oh no. They're kind of confetti balloons. Yeah, they're making confetti balloons. And they pop like little fireworks. Oh, the duck. Okay, I should probably leave. Okay. That was fun. That was definitely not the store I needed. Oh, but I need that. Haha. Yeah. -ha. Oh, here's a store I need. Makers of Fine Wands. Ollivanders. Yes, this is the one I need. Let's go in. Merlin. Blooming beard. Not a gem. Hello? Spin that. Hello? Oh, look at all the wands. Okay, this is if you just want a standard wand, but I probably need one that's custom. Search the box. Hello? Let's ring the bell. <gasps> I'll be right with... Ah. It's you. Um, just a moment, please. What's that? Uh, mm. Hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, I... 
about time. Well, you're our new fifth year student, are you not? Oh, what oh. am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect wand, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes. Mm. Perfect. Powerful core, ten and a half inches. Mm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Okay, let's see. Okay. Well, go ahead, swish. Uh-oh. Hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. I think it might be too powerful. Uh, oh, it's got fireworks inside of it. Oh, I don't think that's right. Is that supposed to well, happen? this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, um... We'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Ooh. Let's give this one a try. Okay. See how this one works. Give it a swish, give it a swirl, here we go. Oh, 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 oh no. Goodness. Oh no. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, Sorry. This is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. That one? I hope it's the right one. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Are you sure? Okay, I can customize the wand so I can pick out different woods, like the natural gray, notched warm brown. Oh, that's so pretty. Look at that. Like unicorn horn, wand core options, the dragon heart string, known for producing powerful magic, unicorn hair, known for producing consistent magic, or phoenix feather, capable of producing a great range of magic. Hmm. We're going with the unicorn. unicorn hair wand is most reliable and faithful to its owner. Oh. Good. What do you think? Got it. Oh, it's powerful. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Indeed. Treat it well, and you shall find no more dependable a wand than one with a unicorn hair core. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Yes, okay. I've got my own special magical wand. That was one of the stops. Now I'm looking for three other places. Let's see if I can find them. Where should I go? This one's open. No, it's locked. Ew, the butcher. Do I even want to know what that big slab of meat is? It might be dragon or something. Excuse me, excuse me. Oh, she's sliding. She's sliding around. Okay, can chop wood on its own. It's kind of scary that an axe just randomly in town can do that. Especially when they don't even have a fire going. It's raining. They're cooking up something here. I just drank that? What was that? Oh no, now what? I can grab an apple? I'm just eating all the food in town. What is he eating? What are you eating? What are you eating? What are you eating? Corn, bacon, sausage. Oh, he's gonna eat it. Yum, right sir? Yeah. Well, they got apples too. They probably just took them. Maybe they're free apples. I mean, nobody was over by that vendor. What are they eating? Oh, same thing, they just finished their meal. <laughs> or unless they magically, oh, they magically, it's like they don't want me to see what they're eating. They're trying to hide it. If I step away, they put their meals back out. If I get closer, boom, vanished. All right, fine, eat your magical meals. What store is this? The cauldron store, shall we? Let's just go in and see all the different cauldrons. Yep, 
every type of finish that you can imagine. If you want copper, iron, stainless steel, they've got it all, including ladles. Oh, and then they've got a giant one going right here. What are they cooking? It's a very nice cauldron store. Oh, here's the one that I need. Tomes and Scrolls, specialist bookshop. Let's go in here. An inquiring mind. Hello. Wow, what a beautiful store you have. What is the magic doing? Oh, something. Cozy fire, you can just sit right here and read. Stare at this cat painting. Oh, you've got a second story. I think you magic, I will have a look. See if there's anything upstairs. Oh, there's a page. Got it. Ah. Oh. What is that? I don't know. It's kind of like a rat bat without wings. Ooh, that's interesting. Hello, sir. You have a beautiful store. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spell crafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here, Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. Mm. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. A potting table and a potion station. Yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want when you want. Okay, great. So I got the spellcrafts. <gasps> the books. They're rearranging. <laughs> this store is so cozy. You know, I think I'm just gonna have a seat right here by the fire. I may read, but I'm definitely gonna pull up my next video where I hope to see you there. Bye cookies, the magic continues in my next video. Bye.